first of all our country was exposed to different other philosophies from about 2000 years onwards slowly and that's how bhagwan shankaracharya ji came and then again gave us that kind of foundation for veda again he strengthened it yes that's one thing second thing is that over a period of time because of historically externally many people have looted us hmm. abject poverty is another problem for us so we are now anybody wanted to give anything anything you know that poverty is is another cause in in the entire streamline hmm. which our priorities have changed in olden days we were having plenty of food clothing eating shelter contented hmm. the more we were exposed to many different worlds and all, not and then others also attacked and then we have become poor under british rule so many things we have faced any problems hmm. so in this entire so many other causes also ultimately led into and then we ourselves stopped teaching our own children the great values in olden days syllabus was different now the see the syllabus hmm. nothing so the all the factors put together hmm. and it said na a, a lie you speak a thousand times it becomes a truth hmm. and the truth is not spoken is forgotten that's true and that is what happened to our country so do you think that we were so busy surviving that we forgot and we put the spirituality aspect of our lives onto a back burner that is one but one major theory and then that also many other other in in basic based on this theory many other complications also have developed in the country right can you uh, enumerate some of them swami ji and then i would like to talk about how a study of vedanta can eliminate them or ameliorate them see first of all the core values which we had earlier hmm. the core values of the culture hmm. no see the, the basically our culture let me talk on culture little bit our culture is what sanatana dharma hmm. sanatanam and nitya nutanam api cha it is ever fresh not only the ancient hmm. so eternal value the values are eternal hmm. so the fundamentally is that our dharma is a foundation for our existence absolutely dharma dharma means our the righteousness duties In that sense, I am talking. Okay. Because dharma is also translated in different, different mm. words. Not, not, not that way. Right. Dharma is our kartavya karma, mm. would do duties. In the entire thing, first of all, the dharma pradhana jivanam is required. Mm. That is to be taught and trained. So when this, what was our dharma? In fact, in our in our culture, vasudeva kutumbam kum bispidar the lakshya we go about it. Then in Ekam Sat Vipraha Bahuda Vadanti, this is a very important thing. Mm. Truth is one. Say just call it by many names. Okay. So our culture is integrated with traditions. Mm. And traditions is actually a capsule given by the Rishis, so that the entire earth is protected. Mm. Oh my God, what a depth I tell you. See. If you follow simple, the the for example, Brahma Yajna, the you know the entire five Yajna, Sanru Yajna, Manusha Yajna is given. All those Yajnas are given. So please just take care of guests, Atidhi Yajna, Brahma Yajna, study of scriptures and all that, Pitru Yajna and all. All those things. Suppose you are doing in, in Bhuta Yajna, Nature Nature. If you incorporate that lifestyle, you are living without disturbing the life around, mm. and you are an asset to the entire environment. Environment around. also. Mm. So, right, that kind of a lifestyle completely was cut off. Mm. Today, every one of us are living selfishly. We mm. don't that 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 uh, the the wisdom, that knowledge, that entire thing that is one one thing, and we are all tuned into the totality and environment. In fact, we don't see anything as a matter as a matter existing independent of spirit. It has to be presiding spirit is there. pervaded by yeah, of course not is the ultimate truth mm. but even in that we say ma- mountain is there there is a presiding parvata raja is there mm. shaila putri parvati we say mm. Mm. nadi devata is there mm. vruksha devata is all there mm. so we treat everything as the the everything is nothing but a devata is presiding mm. so it's an entity living entity mm. so i know how to live mm. so this life when was the our hindu hindu way of life 
which is integrating with the entire thing so that lifestyle is integrated with the entire saving the planet and environment. That knowledge, that lifestyle when you are cut off because of greed, the greed born out of so many other factors again. Mostly again poverty, they are one of the one of the theories I am talking. So this entire thing put up this this unit as a family as a unit and cultural values are cut off. Hmm. And therefore, to again awaken the people, bring that kind of, our culture took care of natural resources, planet, animals, everything it took care. Hmm. Health, warfare required. Hmm. Everything is covered in this. Hmm. But somehow that cut off and then once you cut off from one or one generation you cut off the values now. Next mm -hmm. generation difficult to pick up. It's very easy, very difficult to again train them and then bring them back. 